Just a few days ago, Hypixel released their brand new feature, Hypixel SMP. Hypixel SMP is a feature that allows players to create their own SMPs on Hypixel where they can play with friends. Hypixel SMP is currently restricted to 1.16 only and it will probably stay that way since there isn't really much of a reason to go down to the earlier versions. However, as of now, it is currently in a closed beta to MVP++ only. Since I wanted to make a video on Hypixel SMP, I actually went ahead and bought MVP++, then realized there was an access queue, and then got one of my friends who had the Hypixel SMP to add me to it, but well, I got an MVP++. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into the video. This video will be structured into a few different parts. The first is going over the Hypixel SMP and some different cool things about it, and then I will be answering your questions about the SMP. To get onto the Hypixel SMP, you need to type on slash SMP in Hypixel, which then shows you a menu with the SMPs you are in. If you have MVP++, you can request access, and Hypixel will add you to an access queue where you will eventually get access to, to make your own SMP. Currently, it's only MVP++, however, eventually it will get spread to different ranks, lower ranks. Once you are in your Hypixel SMP, there are a few cool features you can play with. On your SMP, you can use the slash settings command to adjust different settings of your SMP such as difficulty, PvP, game rules, and more. You have access to all the OP commands such as game mode and teleport since, Hypixel, since the SMP is separate to Hypixel. Hypixel states that it has future plans for the SMP to have quality of life changes all the way to custom survival game modes where you can have all to yourself and your friends over the next weeks to months. According to Hypixel, there will be zero impact on the, le on the rest of the server since the SMP is run on separate hardware to the server. The SMP is completely independent to Hypixel. For more extra information, Hypixel has created an FAQ section on their Hypixel SMP thread, which I will link in the description below. Once you are in the Hypixel SMP, you will find that generally it is much like a regular Hypixel world, I mean survival world. Obviously you can customize it in the, the Hypixel will add customization options in the future, I'm certain, as they've said in their thread. They will also allow custom game modes and stuff like that, which is really cool since you can do that all with your friends. Hypixel has also made it possible to make an SMP with your friends where before you might need ROMs or go on servers such as Minehut to make SMPs that a lot of the time did not work as well as desired. Hypixel promises that they will bring a polished and sophisticated experience to making an SMP and playing with your friends. Anyways, now that I've done with the general introduction, I'm going to talk about some questions that people have asked me, and I will cover them to my knowledge. Alright, now we're going to be answering some questions about the Hypixel SMP. The first question is, are Hypixel SMPs are lag as laggy as I other Hypixel you. games? The answer is sometimes. For me, I actually find SMP to be much less oh, laggy than cancel. regular Hypixel. Although the ping is still there since it's Hypixel which is far away from me. However, some people, they experience more lag on the SMP and some people experience the same, so I guess it's variable. The next question is, can you use your own seed in the SMP? And the answer is not right now. When you join an SMP, it takes you into a random seed. I'm assuming it will be added as a feature as time goes on, however. The third question is, will you get banned for hacking? This one I'm not too sure about since I'm not sure if Watchdog is active on Hypixel SMP. I haven't experienced any lag bags or anything. However, I'm going to be asking an admin, and once I find out the answer, I will either make a community post after the video, or I will add it in the editing if he answers me before. The fourth question is if you can do hardcore mode 100 days. The answer is yes, since it's a normal survival world. The fifth question is how good is the SMP compared to an actual SMP host, such as Shockbite or Minehot? The answer is, in my experience, I feel there isn't much lag compared to some of these other hosts. However, there aren't many features. It's still fairly limited in terms of what you can do. So currently I wouldn't get the SMP right now. I certainly wouldn't buy MVP++ just to access the SMP like I tried to do. The fifth question is, the sixth question is, will SMP lag the server? And theoretically it shouldn't since Ipixel SMP is separate to the rest of the server. The seventh question is if the SMP functions the same as other SMPs outside the Hypixel and it's a normal survival multiplayer world, so it should function basically the same with some 
hypixel tweaks which the only thing i found out so far is that you get 64 stake when you start an smp the eighth question is if the smp will give you guild experience and the answer is it will not at least for all my guild members and myself i have not gotten any guild experience playing the smp Another question is, will you be able to add plugins and mod the SMP? And as of now, you can't. It's just a vanilla 1.16 SMP. You can use Luna and stuff like that. I'm not sure if you can use other mods. However, plugins, I'm not too sure. It's still fairly primitive, the Hypixel SMP. So I'm not too sure. I don't think you'd be able to do that now. However, we may see more of these kind of things coming in later. The tenth question is, if there will be a public SMP. And by that, I'm assuming a public SMP that anyone can join. Currently, it's all private. You have to be invited to a person's SMP to join it. However, who knows? We might see more exciting things happening later on in development since it's in beta right now. The 11th question is, if will everyone be allowed to have an SMP later on? Like MVP+, plus, MVP, VIP+, plus, VIP, and nons. I'm, Hypixel did say that eventually they'll roll it out to other ranks, such as with the replay feature. So I'm pretty much certain that MVP+, plus, MVP, and VIP+, plus will be able to access it. I'm not sure about VIP and nons. It might become like a VIP+, plus feature. But, who knows, we may see it available for everyone. The twelfth question is, is how many SMPs can one MVP+, plus person create? And the current is one, since if you create one and you try and create more, it'll say the slots are full. You will probably be able to create more as time goes on. Since it's in beta, they're still experimenting with new technology called by hypixel so we can't really do much right now which is why there's an access queue restricted access etc well i basically talk about what i think the smp could mean for hypixel in the future if you remember a few months ago when i talked about hypixel's new update and why they did it, the practice sped was i told i talked about why it's all about them eliminating competition they made the practice mode just to, I guess, steal some of the competition. I mean, steal some of the audience from Bedwars practice servers. And that's what Hypixel has been doing for quite a while. Bedwars was targeting the Egg Wars community, Sky Wars, Sky based PvP, Jewels, the pot PvP community, which is why they've been able to really dominate multiplayer servers for so long. And they probably still will, since they seem to be pretty smart about it as well. If you look at a server like Mindplex, they did really well when arcade games were popular, but when people lost interest in arcade and started moving to more PvP games, they couldn't adapt, and which is why they aren't really doing as well anymore. Hypixel, on the other hand, managed to switch very well and then benefited off games such as Sky Wars. Hypixel SMP is just another feature, I guess, that is meant to take away more of the eye from all the other that did not make much more sense, but trying to take more audience, trying to capture a bigger audience, just trying to make Hypixel an even bigger server than it is already. Obviously, you see these servers such as Mineheart that create SMPs, and a lot of people actually do use them. A friend of mine uses it, some people in my guild use it, but Hypixel is now seeing that these are quite popular, and they're making Hypixel SMB to just take away these people's, the audience of these genres, and basically growing their server even more. Hypixel SMP is pretty exciting because it brings out a lot of new a lot of new potential, a lot of new options for the server. It's pretty interesting because now you can sort of interact this with gills, things like that. Hypixel is really making sure that they can really have everything in their multiplayer in their Minecraft server. Obviously right now SMP is really small, not much you can do in it, but I'm pretty excited to see where Hypixel takes it to. Obviously, you see something like Bedwars Practice. I predicted that they wouldn't do much to it, and I was right. They only added one new game mode, which, which is just on like the same week that I made my video. And since then, there, there's been absolutely nothing. I don't think SMP will be like that, since it's too big of a thing to just be left in its current state. So uh, I'm pretty excited to see how it will do and what new things Hypixel will add to it. Please feel free to comment your thoughts about SM SMP and Hypixel or whatever else in the comments below. I'm pretty interested to hear your thoughts on Hypixel SMP and the server. How many times have I said I oh, Hypixel SMP this video? There's gonna be one person who counts. And okay, if you if you manage to count how many times I say Hypixel SMP, I will pin your comment in the description. 
if you manage to count. And I will edit the video and I will check how many times I said it just to make sure you have the correct number. So don't say a random number and think, oh, I'm going to pin. Anyway, on more channel stuff. Uh, you guys really liked the Technoblade video that I made, which I think it got 3,000 views in three days, which is more subscribers than my channel has, which is always good to see because it means we're getting a new audience. According to the statistics thing that YouTube shows, 70% uh, of people who watch that did not subs aren't not subscribed, which means that's a good sign. A lot of new people are coming in. Uh, it was it's the best performing video on my channel ever since for the first four days i think right now and yeah that's pretty nice because i think you guys like this informative documentary style video so i will continue making more just like i made this one i'm planning a huge type of documentary video and you guys i think it's something you may like it's relevant to you and i hope it does well as well it will take quite a while to make since I'm trying to edit it really well. I'm trying to make it very polished, very nice, and it's going to be quite a long video as well with scripts and everything, so it will take a while. I might make other videos in the meantime, but don't expect that to come out for... Why am I fighting him when he's a KBC? I don't expect that to come out for at least three weeks to longer since I'm not that free now. Anyways, I've talked about pretty much everything in that i can talk about but this game isn't over yet it should be over by now but here's a KB stick and i just did that so we can just i'm not gonna make this a time lapse old channel fans well not old channel fans but like fans from around 1k subs will remember when i used to do these daily uploads of these short better wars commentaries and they never did well so i stopped them eventually with the vixen thumbnails so yeah you can have like one minute of that I really should not be fighting him. If I was smart, I would go and get emeralds, but I don't think I'm going to lose this still, so I'll do the not very smart move of going in. Anyway, come to the side and I can just... Yep, okay, that, that worked. Alright, everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. hope you learned something. I answered some of your questions about SMP. Things will change since this is a very new video in the development of SMP. But anyways, hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're excited for the big video coming up. Please leave suggestions in the comments. Obviously, person to get the number of Hypixel SMPs will get their comment pinned. But anyways, thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.